guys this is Shaheen and welcome to my channel today we will discuss intermediate first year 1a chapter number 8 inverse trigonometric functions exercise 8a second Roman fifth problem first one show that secant square of tan inverse 2 plus cosecant square of cot inverse 2 equal to 10 I will take let tan inverse 2 equal to alpha that means tan alpha equal to 2 nama same here also cot inverse 2 equal to beta cot beta equal to 2 LHS secant square of tan inverse 2 plus cosecant square of cot inverse 2 secant square tan inverse 2 means alpha cosecant square cot inverse 2 means beta okay this one can I write 1 plus tan square alpha ma identity okay plus here also 1 plus cot square al uh, beta na okay identities 1 plus tan square alpha tan alpha means 2 2 square plus 1 plus cot beta means 2 here square is there 1 plus 4 plus 1 plus 4 1 plus 4 is 5 plus 1 6 plus 4 10 this is RHS hence it is proved okay next second one let find this value cos inverse 4 by 5 equal to alpha cos alpha equal to 4 by 5 so try right rectangle triangle alpha adjacent side by hypotenuse cos means automatically this one is 3 so sin alpha equal to 3 by 5 but here tan is there now so you can take direct tan alpha equal to 3 by 4 okay and tan inverse 2 by 3 equal to beta tan beta equal to 2 by 3 right angle triangle this is beta angle opposite by adjacent okay now you find out this one a b c means a c we don't know a c square equal to 4 plus 9 a c equal to root 13 correct ma okay next but this is we don't want because here tan 1 is there we know that tan of alpha plus beta equal to tan alpha plus tan beta by 1 minus tan alpha into tan beta okay tan alpha value ma 3 by 4 tan beta is 2 by 3 1 minus 3 by 4 into 2 by 3 3 3 will cancel cross multiplication 9 plus 8 by 12 4 number 4 minus 2 here also cancel na. 2 2 minus 1 by 2 9 plus 8 is 17 by 12 into this one here 1 mana 1 na. So, 2 by 1. 2 1s are 2 6 are. That means 17 by 6 is the value of tan of alpha plus beta. Therefore, tan of alpha means cos inverse 4 by 5. Beta means tan inverse 2 by 3 equal to 17 by 6 okay this is the second solution next third one if sin inverse x minus sin inverse 
sorry sin inverse x minus cos inverse x equal to pi by 6 then find x okay let sin inverse x equal to alpha sin alpha equal to x and cos inverse x equal to beta cos beta equal to x correct ma okay next see beta question given sin inverse x minus cos inverse x okay what are the given 1 by 2 correct sorry pi by 6 okay sin inverse x sin inverse x means alpha minus cos inverse x means beta equal to pi by 6 now taking sin on both sides so sin of alpha minus beta equal to sin pi by 6 sin of alpha minus beta sin of a minus b formula sin alpha into cos beta minus cos alpha into sin beta equal to sin of pi by 6 means 1 by 2 next sin alpha into cos beta minus cos alpha can i write root 1 minus sin square alpha ma okay this one can i write sin 1 minus cos square beta equal to 1 by 2 sin alpha means x cos alpha also x minus root 1 minus x square into 1 minus x square equal to 1 by 2 x into x x square minus 1 minus x square root 1 minus x square 1 min root 1 minus x whole square equal to 1 by 2 square root cancel x square multiply with minus 1 plus x square equal to 1 by 2 2 x square equal to 1 by 2 plus 1 2 x square equal to 1 plus 2 by 2 2 x square equal to 3 by 4 x square equal to 3 by 8 x equal to plus or minus root 3 by 2 2 sorry here 4 ma. 2 4 okay so this is the required value okay ma so this is about question number 5 solution next class we will discuss question uh, next to roman first problem okay thank you for watching my video take it all of you